It's cheese, of course. Cheese? Yeah, I wanted to show everybody <laughs> that we get cheese delivered to ourselves, but I wanted to share with everybody what's actually in the pack. Cheese? When it, apart from <laughs> cheese, how we pack it. How do we keep it cool when we put it yes. through the post, express post? So, yes. I, as you can see, it gets sent express. Now, mm. we need scissors. Have you got scissors? Oh. Of course she does. <laughs> Alright, open it up. Let's see. Oh, I got okay. something very special in this Ooh, cheese pack. I can't wait. I can... Mm, I know, it smells good. aroma of cheese. cheese. So good. So, this is how it arrives just for Australia Post. Isn't it? Yep, it's not, it's not how it goes with our trucks. No, so look at here, look at here. So, oh, mm. I actually got us two oh, cheese packs. Oh, you got packs. two packs? Yeah. Ooh. Is that one for me and one for you? Look at those, they're nice and icy oh. cold. So, they're not, it's not completely frozen, but. Um, still frozen, really still hot. ice in there. Yeah. So, this was sent from oh, Melbourne, nice. we're on the Sunshine Coast, and Today is Wednesday, yes. this left Monday, so it's yes. been through the post for a couple of days. It's nice and cold. Look at that, Ooh, oh, that's nice. that is beautiful and nice and cold. Firstly, before we get into the cheese, oh, okay. let me show you this part. So we've seen the gel packs. We also have a wool. So this yes. is a wool liner that we use, which because <laughs> to be honest, I hate the I don't hate the, the taste, taste of polystyrene. <laughs> I hate the sound of it. It's awful and it's bad for the environment. Yeah. So we went on a search four years ago to try and find something to replace polystyrene. And that's where we came up with this. It's a wool liner. And this is the wool that the, the farmers couldn't mm. sell. So it's a base of a reject wool. They wash it, make it into a matting and it performs better than polystyrene. And I've had people send me photos of, you know, <laughs> of their animals using it as babies. <laughs> So that is how we keep the cheese cooked. Now, yes. this is the most exciting part. This though. is the most exciting part oh, because packs are these? this one here, look, oh. it's oh. the therapy box. Oh, yeah. How nice does that look? Oh, look at wow. That. I actually haven't seen our latest Ooh, one yet. A special gift for Ooh. you. Ooh. Oh, how nice. Nice. Oh, that's right. I've got a corporate tasting tomorrow night. That's what this is oh. for. Yes. Yeah. Oh, look, some delicious cheese yeah. from Chris Lloyd. That's called Fibonacci. Oh. We're oh, going to go get that? to this one last. Uh, how this nice is that? Beautiful look? blue cheese. Yeah. What's that called? That is blue orchid. Well done. River. Nice one. Yeah. Mm, Fontina Vecchio mm. from uh, section 28. This yeah. is the August therapy box pack. These are out now. This one. Oh, oh man. Oh, mm, how man. beautiful does that smell? I this reckon cheese, you can almost smell that through the I know. <laughs> this cheese has never been tasted before. <laughs> Apart from the cheese maker, it's been made especially for this pack by yes. Mellowa. It's called Toriong. It's a wash rind goat's cheese. Yes. We haven't even tasted it, and it's the only time this cheese will be produced in this August pack. And one of our fans named this cheese too. That's right, yeah. Marsha Bergman. Yeah. And it was named Toriong because that's the name of the river that runs past Mellowa. The European name of the river is the Ovens River. So how cool is that? Yeah, that's cool. Um, and what you also get in the therapy box are tasting notes. So each of the cheeses have little tasting notes about them, how to pair it with mm -hmm. what wines, beers, but also other foods, whether it's nuts or something like that. So mm -hmm. every cheese in your box gets that. Right, yeah. now I got to something else because I'm so nice. <laughs> right, this is, ta-da! The Mafra pack. Mafra is about three hours east of Melbourne, made by a, an amazing lady out there called Ferial. And she's been making English style cheeses for, I don't know, it seems forever. Mm. And she's really nailed it. So, it's look a beautiful at, looking pack. Look sure at the is. Colors and I, know. Shapes. It's really I know. Nice. So, we've got a Red Leicester, a very typical English cheese. They're all pretty much mm. very typical English. A nice wax bound cheddar. Mm. Mm. What are we going to have tonight? Oh, um, and then look, a Wensley Dale. Yeah, yeah. Like, does this stuff get any more English? So this one looks really nice. This is yeah. a Wensley Dale with the um with the cranberries. The cranberries. Oh. You see that? So yum, 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 yum. So this is an all hard pack. We've never done a pack with mm. just all hard cheeses before. Yeah, we had a lot of people asking for mm. a, a, an all hard cheese. Mm. Very low in lactose. Yes. Uh, but also no blue cheeses as well. So a lot of people asking for that. <laughs> but also. The other thing, 
for uh, women who are pregnant yes. can still indulge yep. in their hard cheeses. Yep. Perfect yeah. pack, perfect pack. <laughs> so there we have it. That, my dear, is your Mafra pack, your August therapy box. Thank you. You're a lucky okay, girl. I'm just going to eat them now. <laughs> <laughs> of course you. <laughs>